Hello YouTube. Right now I'm going to show you an application that will allow you to download any file whether it's mp3, video, flv, <clears throat> pdf, document, any file whatsoever uh, that you can find online onto your iPad, iPhone, or iTouch without having to be jailbroken. Now the application I'm talking about is uh, called Goodreader which is this one right here and you can actually find it um, for free at the App Store. It's a real, it's a real good file management um, application. It it doesn't compare to the file I file management from from Cydia. However, for all you non jailbroken um, iPhone users, this is a good alternative. So let's just get a rundown of the application itself. Over here, you'll see that you will have preview where you could just click on a file and uh, preview uh, a clipping of the a thumbnail I guess you could say um, of the a file will appear then you have find files where you can search files um, that you have saved onto your computer let me just move this back then you have manage files which will allow you to either copy the file, move the file, zip the file email the file, rename it, link, um, open in another application, uh, create a new folder for it, or create new text for the file. And then you have web downloads. Now here on the web downloads you will be able to download um, any file using the browser in application browser. However, the browser itself is pretty fast, so and downloading is also pretty fast. So it's real good, depending on your 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 carrier, however. As far as uh, browsing and lags, I haven't experienced any of that. And you could either download using uh, a URL or just browsing the web, and then it'll give you downloads in progress, recent downloads, remote sync and then at the end you'll have connect to server where you, where you can connect to your computer or your, you can connect to the files from your computer using Wi-Fi however um, once you connect your your iDevice onto your computer using this application you will be able to export or import files uh, right off from your iTunes so that's pretty good. Now let me just show you how what I mean when you can download anything. I like using Foreshare for an example. However, um, I won't be able to do music, MP3, or anything like that because due to copyright and fragment, I've already been warned. So um, I can't do that anymore. Anyways, um, right here, let's say you wanted to download a PDF file for a book that you want. Not that I'm suggesting you guys go do that however any file whatsoever and then you'll have a complete list of PDF files for you, you to download and then um, let me just go ahead and click on this one it's a thousand most common English words in English or something and then you click on download now you go ahead and follow the link since the link um, the only link that you need to download file from link is the actual link for the download the actual one that triggers the download so uh, right now if you're not a premium user you have to wait 20 seconds for four share so once you get the link you go ahead and click download link to file and then it says downloading has started check web download section and um, as you can see it's already downloaded uh, it downloads pretty fast and then you'll be able to view just by clicking on the file and you'll also be able to export just by connecting it to iTunes <clears throat> so like I said this um, web browser allows you to go to anywhere any website of your preference and download files from there. And for those of you who don't jailbreak your device or anything like that, then this is a 
a good way for you guys to do it. I actually downloaded an application for you guys to actually do jailbreak. You'll be able to download applications through whatever website and then you can either install it via terminal or whatever. So um, that's it. Don't forget to rate, com rate, rate comment, <laughs> subscribe. I'm sorry, I can't speak today. And y'all have a good luck, a good day, and good luck.